The side judge is Gary LaForce, and the back judge is Buddy Horton. The Vikings are coached by Rob Smith, and his hands, as you can hear, on their feet just down below it. And we're ready to rock and roll here in the Arco Bowl, sponsored by Arco Products, first round NAIA Division II football game. We're waiting for Blake Lozo to blow that whistle. He checks his watch. Now Blake sticks it in his mouth and blows it, and we're underway. A low driving squib kick, bouncing, bouncing, picked up by Spears at the 17, across the 25, stood up. Falls forward to the 32, first and 10 from the 30 to the near side. Henderson far side, Christian the tailback. Lone setback, Kitna under center, Malmberg over the football. Now Roots on motion back towards the formation. Kitna long count, play action, going to throw it over the middle. Almost intercepted, Mark Spencer. KGMI News Plus, AM 790. Same formation, Roots on near side, Henderson far side, Christian the setback, Kitna. The senior out of Lincoln High in Tacoma, under center. Vikings showing blitz. Kitna, play action, throws a little one out here to Russo. Steps by man, 30, 35. Spencer with a saving tackle at the 45-yard line. And Russo, short or no gain. 14-yard pickup, first and 10 for the Wildcats. First possession of the ball game. Woodard and Spencer. And Spencer set to the far side. Kitna all day to throw, being chased, throws, caught by Woodard, and he's wrestled down at the Viking 48. Point it to Josh Woodard, the sophomore from Auburn. L.J. Troutman checks in. They've got trips to the near side with Troutman, Henderson, and Woodard. They pitch it to Christian, got some room to run. He's tripped up, stood up, and dropped, and he appears, though, to have the first down. So for the Wildcats, first and 10 on uh, Viking 42-yard line. Trips to the far side, the wide side of the field. Russo set to the near side. Christian, the lone setback. As the Vikings have to adjust their coverage. Boy, what a mismatch out here. Kitna, looking, looking. Throws it to the fullback, and Spencer grabs Christian by the jersey and hauls him down. Your leadership, just like that, he was the one that averted that big play. Troutman, Henderson, and Woodard again out to the far side as they go with trips to that side. Boy, it doesn't look like anybody's covering the slot back. Now they get somebody over on Woodard. Second down and four. From the Vikings, 36, long count. They're going to throw the quick screen. The Vikings get out there pretty well. But Woodard, a nice run with the football and appears to have a central two and it marched it right down the field. Third and a yard from the Western 33-yard line. Wide receiver set either side. Now Todd Murray steps back. Man in motion, going to run it to the far side. Christian has a first down and more. And a nice tackle by Tim Hansen, but a couple of 10 for the Wildcats from their own, from the Viking 30. Trips to the wide side with Troutman, Henderson, and Woodard. Christian the setback. Russo set to the short side of the field. First and 10. Wildcats on the march. Kitna straight back. Plenty of time. Looks, throws, overthrows, almost intercepted. Henderson on a deep. With a free safety uh, open to cover anybody, and nobody picked up Henderson coming out of there. Double wide, both sides of the field. Second and 10 Wildcats from the Viking 30-yard line. No score. About three and a half minutes into the ball game. The draw play to Christian. Christian is hit by his ankles. Mark Spencer shooting in there and grabbed it here so far. Now will force the Wildcats to a third and seven from the Western 28-yard line. Double wide near side. One set back. Russo set to the short side. Long count by Kitna. Kittner straight back into the pocket, looking, 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 fires over the middle, caught Henderson, 15, grabbed by Randy Carter and dropped at the 11. Wide. Covered, then broke it back into the middle, and uh, there was nobody there. So Central with a 21-yard pickup on that one, and they have it first and 10 on the Viking 11-yard line. Kittner under center. John calling out the signals, fumbles the football, and I think Kittner got it. We'll wait and see. So Kitna trying to pull out a little too soon that Littler and South the guards, Barkin and Dahl, the tackles, giving Kitna CFA's all-time leading passer ample time. He's audible at the line of scrimmage. Now Russo comes in motion to the short side of the field. Four seconds on the game clock, two seconds, one. They get it off. Kitna back, pressured, throws to the end zone, in and out of the hands of the intended receiver. And McIntosh was just flat. Until it had bounced off of Russo. He had his back turned to the play the whole time, which was his first mistake. 
Third down and long from the 12. Here comes the blitz up the middle of the field. They throw it out. Russo there, but they oh, and they're going to call pass interference. And I will break for the Vikings. And instead, it gives Central Washington a first and goal at the seven-yard line. It should have been fourth down, but instead, McIntosh called for holding. Here come the Vikings. Rorabaugh on the blitz, and he's pointing at... And I think Western's got to come with pressure on Kitna again. They've got to make him hurry his throw. They can't give him time to sit and find a receiver. Trips to the wide side. That's the near side. Kitna straight back. Here comes the blitz. It's an inside screen to Russo at the five. Runs through the tackle. He's close. And he's stopped shy of the goal line. So a successful. Second and goal for the Wildcats. They've driven on this opening drive from the 32 all the way down the field. Christian will probably get the ball on this one. Kitna under center. Malmberg. Ready to snap the football, gives it to Christian. He thunders forward, and it's very close. Well, Western linebacker. Yeah, that's not a bad call either. Third and about a half a yard. No score. Tight end steps back in the slot. He's in motion. Kitna is grabbed, and he is stuffed for a loss. Oh, my. Huge play by the Vikings. As player right on the pitch, man, it would have gone the other way. So the, so the Wildcats line up for a field goal. And that's amazing. Greg Stoller will put it down, and Marty Greenley will hit it. The ball will be marked at the nine, just like an extra point. It's spotted. The snap, block, block, and the Vikings hold. They block the, the field goal and take her in the holder, and then just flat laid out and got his hands on the ball. Vikings take over scoreless. First and ten on the western five-yard line after Central is denied. In motion, Evans, hand off to Bruno, right up the middle of the field. John takes it from the five, out pretty close to the 10. And they're just trying to get in on the play. Uh, Central only knocking on the door, and they come up not only without a touchdown, but empty, zero points. Second and five Vikings from their own 10-yard line. I formation, Wiggins and Bruno behind Styles. Jason's going to throw it, lays it out there, nickel there, a leaping catch for the Vikings at the 35-yard line. No, you put it up there, he'll go get it. First and 10 for the Big Blue, 5.55 to go first quarter. The Central is controlled, but no score so far. Christian Evans in motion, long count by Styles. Delay, they give it to Bruno, trying to pick his way, and Central on an inside blitz, slamming. Time, and if, if it's a run, the pressure is going to be there before the blocks can be made. If it's a pass, they're going to try and make Styles throw or run. Second down and 13, uh, Western from their own 32. Quick count, Styles retreats, Bruno flares out of the backfield. Palmore open on a crossing pattern and drop the football. Kevin, Palmore, I that situation. Uh, key fault by the receivers, you've always got to catch the ball first. Palmore drops it and he checks out. Bruno on the lone setback. Nickel and Costello set to the uh, wide side. Christian Evans in motion, Styles straight back. Double team on Lawanga, they throw it to Lamont. Eludes one tackler, almost fumbles. And a Wildcat comes flying in to Trey Macon back to receive the punt back at his own 20-yard line. Eric Marin standing back uh, just inside his 20, about the 17. Good snap, plenty of time, low driving boot. Chases Macon all the way back to the five-yard line. He fumbles the football, steps up inside a couple of Viking defenders, and gets hammered at the 12-yard line. Macon, after he was stood up, Cats from their own 13 with four minutes to go in the first quarter. End around to Josh Sarpy. Penalty flag down. Sarpy steps through two Vikings and takes it all the way out to the 20-yard line. A nice run by the one to be named. First down in a country mile. The Wildcats back on their own four-yard line. They've got to take it all the way out to their 24. In motion, Russo. Hand off to Christian. Take First down, central back at their three. They've got to take it out to the 24. So first down and 21. In motion, Russo to the wide side of the field. Western shows blitz. Kitna back into the pocket. Looking, plenty of time. Now gets a little pressure. Dumps it out to Christian. And McIntosh, Submarines, and Christian. That's in 15 seconds to go in a scoreless first quarter in the Arco Bowl. Central Washington against top-ranked Western Washington here at Civic Stadium in Bellingham. Kitna with double wide to the wide side of the field. Gets the snap, drops straight back. Pressure could be holding. Throw and a diving catch made at the 31-yard line. Russo and Henderson come out to the wide side of the field. Other than that, everyone in tight. Kitna under the center, Malmberg. 
Rolls to the right, pump fake to the left, looks, and the tight end drops the ball. Could be ruled a lateral. Let's wait and see. Yeah, uh, incomplete. He's really won. They send the trip formation in with Woodard, Henderson, and Troutman to the near side. One wide out to the far side. Kitna in the shotgun. Second and ten. No score. Hand off to Christian. Scoops pass one defender and takes it out backers inside Orlando Steinauer supplied a big play defensively for the Vikings in their first meeting and let's see if he can make something big happen here third down and seven the ball at the central 35 here comes the blitz Kitna rolls back it's the screen and he over and Spencer was the guy that messed that one up you're absolutely correct Greg Stoller back to kick it away Eric Marin hit a 60 yarder in his first punt let's see what they have coming here and don't discount a fake either. Malmberg, high snap, but not much pressure. And a low wobbly kick that uh, almost hits the Viking and it does. does. John Wamba, it hit his back heel and Central covers it. Pounced on the ball and Central gets a huge wide to the near side as Kitna fades back. Plenty of time, pump fake, gonna throw to Henderson. He's there, touchdown Central Washington. Henderson. Well, Henderson wasn't the original receiver. Wamba had the original receiver very well covered, and so uh, Kitna went to his secondary receiver, and uh, I think you're right, Orlando got caught looking in. The snap, the spot, the kick is away, and good. Time out on the... On the guide at Pole Road, locally owned Midway Chevron has a convenient food... ...face when uh, John Wamba loses track of the football, and Central kicks it away, driving Ryan Wiggins back to his six-yard line across the 10, 15, 20, 25, 30... 30-yard line, still on his feet, running through an official 40. Ryan Wiggins across midfield and dragged down at the central. Played a, a huge block to springing open right early on the kickoff. Trips to the far side, wide side of the field. Central on top, 7-zip. Bruno the setback. Central on top, 7 to nothing. Styles throws a quick screen to Palmore. Gets around the corner, 40. Kevin close to a first. Hey, going Palmer would have been dropped for a loss, but Nichols stuck with his man and kept him out. Gain of 11 for the Vikings. First and 10 from the Wildcats, 33. 114 to go in the first quarter. Trips to the wide side. That's this side, the near side of the field. Central coming on a blitz. A handoff to Bruno. Steps by one tackler at the 35. Get career 100-yard rushing days. Was trailing Pat Locker by 49 yards. Bruna entering with 4,000 career rushing yards. Second down and seven. Palmore in motion. Wide out set either side. Styles straight back. Plenty of time. Dumps it out here to Bruna. Bruna to catch at the 30. To the 25 and knock back to the 20. Something is happening down at Valley Plumbing and Electric. Yep. Looks like they're expecting something really. Has only had it for eight plays. And one big play was the, was the punt uh, that uh, bounced off of Wamba's heel. Third down for the Vikings from the Central Washington 27. Audible being called. Double wide near side. Offset eye behind Stiles. Central may have jumped offside. Bruno trying to get room to run, and he's in trouble. John at the 30 and dropped at the 28. Well, Erath kneeling at the 36. It's a, it's a pooch kick by Gabers. And will they down it? They have a shot. And I don't know if they did or not. Let's yes, wait and see. It's on the one. And they tails it inside the one. And this is where the Viking defense needs to come up big. They trail it seven to nothing. Wildcats first and ten from inside their one. Jamie Christian behind Kitna. Seven nothing central. Handed off to Christian. Big hole across the five, ten. First down carry out to the 16 yard line. Wide split for the pass rush, but central is. Uh, Hurt him with some interior running. First and ten, a big one for the Wildcats from their own 16. They've dominated and lead it seven to nothing. Kitna under center. Fakes to Christian. Got a man open. Throws in and out of the hands of Russo and almost a late hit by Isaac. It's seven to nothing. Top rank Western against 14th rank Central. Double wide near side. Wildcats second and ten from their own 16. Western showing blitz, here they come, and they fling it out here to Christian. Nice 360 spin, and he's close to a first down, out to the to apply some consistent pressure. Wildcats third down and a foot from the Western 25, from the uh, Central 25-yard line. Double wide near side. Kitna gets the snap, hands off to Christian. Stuff falls forward, and I think has the first down. Excellent second effort by Christian right there. He was hit. Plays in his right hand. That plastic sheet containing his script, he hasn't had much opportunity to call those offensive plays. 
First and ten Wildcats from their own twenty from the their own twenty-seven. Wide open Henderson. He's got another catch. And down to the western. And Isaac Bloom couldn't get there in time to stop the reception. Henderson and Woodard split out to the far side. Roos on near side. First and ten Wildcats. Western's defense needs to make a big play. Back goes Kitna. Kitna over the middle. Woodard wide open and makes the catch as he before Central Washington there on the Viking 24. First down and 10. The Wildcats lead at 7 to nothing with 12 minutes to go in the first half and they're driving. Trips on the far side of the field. Kitna surveys the defense. Vikings show blitz. Now they back out of it. Kitna long count. Audible you know, at the line of scrimmage. Plenty of time on the play clock. About 8 seconds to go. Here comes the blitz. It's a little dump inside screen to Russo. He breaks free. 20, 15, 10. Touchdown. Central Washington. They can't be running the first down, you know, three yards in a cloud of dust. They've got to start putting the ball in the air and doing some different things. Marty Greenlee on to try the PAT, a high snap. The spot, the kick is away. It looks good, and it is. Timeout on the field, 11.50. For the Kubota Grand L Tractor from Skolton Equipment. Kick by Wade Gabers, 35-yarder to pin central inside their one, and they go 99 and a half yards for the score. Scoring on an inside screen from Kitna to Russo. And uh, the Viking offense now has to uh, carry the burden as uh, they've uh, averaged 39 a game, and they're going to have to get into gear for the Vikings to bounce back in this one. Yeah, and uh, there wasn't anything, John uh, Bruno, and start using some of your other uh, weapons that you have. 14 to nothing. Last time the Vikings got a kick. Ryan Wiggins brought it back 50 yards, but the Vikings could not score, and the officials kill the play upfield than what they should have. They had it on the wrong hash mark. There's two hash marks, one the college and one the high school, and they had it on the high school hash mark, so they had to move it in. So after the unsportsmanlike penalty, Central will kick off from the 20. They boom it down the field. Wiggins backing to his 14, to the 20, 25, 30. Takes a hit, spins away, still driving, out to the 36-yard line. First of the day, they trail 14-zip. Trips to the wide side, Paul Moore, Casello, and Nickel. Bruna on the lone setback. Kitna, excuse me, Styles under center. John Kitna, the central quarterback, been out there the whole afternoon. Matt Cross over the ball. Snaps to uh, Styles. Hits Palmore across the 45. He's driven forward and loosened up a little bit. First and 10 Vikings on their own 47 yard line. They trail 14 to nothing. 11 minutes, 10 seconds to go in the first half. Dominated by the Wildcats thus far. Play action to Bruna. That's a good call. They're going to toss it out here to Costello, and Nickel has the ball bounce off his hands, and it is intercepted, and it's Western that's hurting itself. First and 10 Central from their own 20-yard line. They lead it 14-zip. Trips to the far side of the field as Kitna retreats. Plenty of time, throws it over the middle. Christian wide open out of the backfield and takes it out to the 48-yard line. Kitna has all the time in the world. And the Wildcats on a roll, leading at 14 to nothing. Trips to the far side. First and 10 Wildcats, Kit in the back. Three-step drop, now rolls right. Thumps it over the middle, caught by Henderson at the Viking 35. He's hit and dropped at the 30. They need to go more to straight man-to-man -man coverage, uh, you know, and really play tight on those guys. So the Vikings come out of the timeout, trailing at 14 to nothing. They've been hammered around uh, this field like a, a boxer. They're still on their feet, but Kitna and the Wildcats trying to uh, jump out in front by three scores. Kitna from the shotgun, first and ten Wildcats on the Viking 30-yard line. Central on the march, trips to the wide side, and it's a handoff to Christian. He's hit and stopped for a yard gain. And draw a chance to set up. Central's added a no huddle from the shotgun. Kitna from the 29, dumps it out here to Christian. He runs over a back, and he's dumped at the 22. Christian's the only guy open. Third and two for Central from the Western 22. Kitna back, pump fake, and almost split the sack. They dump it over the middle, and Kitna throws it away. Chad Rorabaugh really up. First down and a yard and a half from the Western 22. High formation. In motion, the tight end. Kitna hands it off to Christian, and he is stuffed for no gain, and the Vikings take over on down. They have run rings around the Western defense, fourth and two in the gear. As the defense has kept the Vikings from being run right out of Civic Stadium, they trail at 14-zip. The Vikings from their own 20. 
Bruna right up the gut. Bruna bangs it out from the 22 to the 20th round NAIA Division II playoff game owned thus far by 14th ranked Central Washington. Trips to the wide side of the field. Bruna the setback. Second and seven. Vikings from their own 25. Styles under center. Jason now audible in at the line of scrimmage. Long count. Back. Dumps it over the middle. Misses his roommate, Paul Moore. And he gets an extra twitch, which has led directly to a central score. Trips to the near side. Paul Moore, Costello, and Nico. Bruna on the lone setback. Third and seven Vikings from their own 25. Styles back. Plenty of time, looking, no place to run, in trouble. Throws it over the middle, a prayer, incomplete. Tipped and falls incomplete, he's lucky that time, and he is hurt. Besides being real easy to get to, our new store is chock full of brand new table lamps, floor lamps, and hanging fixtures that have just arrived for our fall catalog savings event. We've even received a special shipment of festive lampshades and decorations, just in time for your holiday entertaining. You see, we're really happy to finally be in our new store. And we're sure you'll be happy about how easy it is to find and how you can find finally found our coffee maker. Ball, almost the entire first half. They lead it 14 zip. They've got it first and 10 from their own 43. Kitna, play action. Back into the pocket and whistles. The defense has got to set the table for the offense here right now. They've got to come up with some plays. Rusa and Henderson set to the wide side. Christian the setback. Second, first down and 15 for Central from their own 37. Here comes pressure. Kitna in trouble, eludes the blitz. Holding will be the call. Kitna running for his life is hammered by Brian Mackin. Wildcats penalized back to their own 22, so back-to-back -back penalties. First down and a country mile. They've got to go to Western 47. Trips to the wide side, the near side. Christian the setback. Audible at the line of scrimmage. Christian with the carry, bangs it out to the 25, then he stood up and ridden down. Seven minutes, 35 seconds to go in a first half, dominated by the Wildcats. Fritz to the near side, second down and long from the central 25. Christian behind Kitna, Kitna backpedals. Here comes Nate Spitzer, Kitna stepping up, running. He's to the 30, 35, heading out of bounds, driven out of bounds by Brian Mack. Third down for Central. They're on their own 36. They've got to get to the Western 47-yard line. Trips to the far side of the field. Roussan near side. New running back in there. No, it is Christian. As Kitna backpedals, throws over the middle, and Roussan bobbles the ball, and Carter bangs him too. And a short kick turned out to be a huge break because it bounced off the foot of John Wamba. Good snap to Stoller. The former Camas High kid booms it down the field. Very nice kick. Steinauer grabs the ball, steps away from a tackle, and he's thumped down at the 18-yard line. Knocked down at his own 18. You're a little of Linfield College. Ed here is the NAIA game committeeman. First and 10 for the Vikings. They're on their own 18. They trail it 14 to nothing. Brun on the setback. In motion, Christian Evans. Styles back in a quarterback, hands off to Bruno, stiff arms one man, approaches the 20, 25, 30, 35, John to the 40, and takes a big hit out to the 40. 35 seconds to go in the first half, owned by Central Washington. Double wide to the wide side, Nickel and Costello. Now Mario comes in motion, offset eye, first and 10 from the Viking 41, and with it is Ryan Wiggins, no game here in the last five minutes, like a litany of Central offensive statistics. Second down and 10 Wildcats. Vikings from their own 41-yard line. Wildcats lead it 14 to nothing. Paul Moore in the slot. Styles back. Here comes the blitz, and he's run over and dropped back at his 31. 10-yard long forward progress to Styles to the 34-yard line, making it third down and 17. Frazier and Bruna behind Styles, who pumps. Throws the home run. Evans is out there, and it's intercepted by Tony Bowie, who's knocked down at the tight end Evans in double coverage, and the Wildcats picked it off. And 10 and 10 from their own 32-yard line. Trips to the far side. Christian behind John Kitna, and it's an inside. No, it's a play action. Kitna on a bootleg right. Throws wide open. Russo, 45 of, of Western, 40, down to the 34-yard line and 33 yards. 
Well, Western's defenders right now are looking back in the backfield and watching what's happening instead of focusing on the receivers. Trips to the wide side, first and 10 central from the Viking 34. Kit in the back, dumps it to the running back, Christian 30, drops his head, and the Lanier capacity crowd here at Civic Stadium struck silent by the impressive Central Washington Wildcats who lead it 14 to nothing. Second down and short from the Viking 26. Kit in the back, all night to throw, dumps it, and it's in and out of the hands of the tight end. Western's gonna have to start coming up with some blitzes or something to maybe try, try and change the momentum here. Trips to the short side, Woodard, Russo, and Henderson. Christian the setback, 14 zip Wildcats. Play action, handoff to Christian, thundering forward, goes the 230 pound senior. Bane here in the first two periods, and Western, unlike the regular season, has really hurt themselves with Kima State. Second and two central. Trying to get a touchdown, which could break this one wide open. Kitna, watching the game clock tick down, is going to let it tick down to the crowd here watching Central Washington dissect Western. Uh, 14 to nothing, second and short for the Wildcats from the Western 16. They give it to Christian. Stood up and sunk backwards by inside two minutes to go in the first half, dominated by Central, 14 to nothing, third down and short. Kit in the back, dumps it out here to Christian, runs by one tackler, but John Bergford with a good stop. And first down yardage. So Central has owned the first half, and I'm not sure the Vikings could come back from a three TD deficit. First down and 10 from the Viking 12, 130 to go in the first half. Kitna. Surveying the defense, three-step drop, throws it out here, the catch, and the play. And you're this deep in this territory, you gotta be right up on top of that guy. So Christian the setback, Henderson one side, Russo the short side, they're gonna throw the slant, and almost intercepted by Tim Hansen. He read that baby perfectly. He looked for this afternoon. Viking fans on their feet. Huge play, could be the season right here for Western. They're down 14 zip, central third and three from the Viking five and a half yard line. Henderson to the far side, Russo to the near side and short side. Christian the running back, hit in the back, fires it, almost intercepted by Randy Carter. Could be a, 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 a tough task this afternoon. It'll be because the defense managed to stave off the, Viking, the Wildcats now the third time inside the 20. Marty Greenlee to attempt a field goal. Stoller puts it down, the kick is away, and it is wide right and no good. I think somebody got a fingertip. Right. Uh, I'll tell you what, uh, you're absolutely right. It could very well be offense to 73 for Western. And the Vikings need to throw shorter crossing routes with a minute 13 left. A touchdown here would be a huge boost. The handoff to Bruna, trying to pop through the middle and takes it out to the 20. And try and put something in, but they're not going to make a big crucial mistake. From their 25, second and five with 40 seconds to go. They're going to pitch it to Bruna. Got a whole bunch of people out blocking. John to the 30, falls forward to the 30. Most opportune time, but uh, hey, if, if you can get it going, use it. 20 seconds to go, and Bruna running this side. John stops at his 25, looking for room, grabbed and hogged. From ABC News, I'm Joe. Here, hash mark at his seven. Greg Stoller from Camas, uh, line drive kick. And it rolls to Eric Butler, who takes it at the 12 to the 20. He's hit and slammed down at the 20. Studio producer engineer, Jeff Sticklett. And uh, I formation with Wiggins and Bruna. Nickel, the only wide out. The tight end, Evans, is the slot back. It's a give to Bruna, running near side. John cuts back, takes it from the 25 out to a battle. The blue clad Vikings, number one ranked NAIA team. Coming into this afternoon's ball game, they were the pole champ, but it is the second season. Styles three-step drop, rolls right, backside pursuit, throws, gets a hit late, no penalty flag, seen to nothing. Casello and Nichols split out to the wide side, eye formation, maybe Casello this time might be the target. They haven't thrown a ball in his direction all day. Styles retreat, good time, looking, nobody open, hit, fumble. Scramble, and I think the Wildcats have it. On Rakovich with the tackle, and Doug Murkovich, check opportunity to blow this one open. And we have an injury, Styles is shaken up. His right shoulder appears to be hurt, and Darren Erath may be called on to come into the ball game. 
First and 10 central from the Viking 25. They throw it to the tight end, Dolan Holt, at nine. Second and one from the 15. 14 nothing central. Double wide far side. Hold in motion, play action. Kitna over the middle, throws, and a diving foot. First and goal central from the six. Three step drop, they throw the fade. Touchdown central wide. All back. Marty Greenlee for the PAT, the snap, the spot, the kick, it's up, and it is... Bel Air Heating and Air Conditioning knows a good thing when they see it. That's why they... Fourth turnover by the Vikings this afternoon, line drive boot. Ryan Wiggins takes it at the 6, to the 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, runs through a tackle, bangs it out to the 33. To, to the defense, and uh, maybe the offense can be a little more successful. Trips to the wide side of the field, first and 10, Western from their own 33, handoff to Bruna, jukes a man is run down and, and they have been going after it all day long they've dominated from the opening kickoff double trips to the far side erath under center second and nine western from their own 34. erath play action reverse roll scrambling for his life runs out of trouble gets away from luanga throws it to the tight end to travis cruz and we've got some final scores to relay to you here momentarily high formation third down and about 15 yards. I formation as Erath drops way back. Looks, throws the home run. Nickel out there and makes the catch at the, cent the central 37. A gain of 42 yards. Bruna comes in motion. Nobody in the backfield now. Erath drops straight back. Going to throw it out here to Palmore on the screen. Good block. Kevin to the 35. Submarine and drop at the 14 of their points after Western turnover. Second and three Vikings, Erath at quarterback. Styles was injured here at the start of the second half. Wiggins and uh, Bruna behind Darren. It's a hand, up. it's a reverse, a fake reverse. And Bruna, a pass to Wiggins. Oh, he didn't catch the football. Third down and three from the central 29. Casello and Nickel to the wide side, I formation. Erath under center, Matt Cross there. Erath straight back, here comes the blitz. He throws the bomb, Costello out there, and knocked away at the last instant, a spectacular play. Turn from the Central 29, and maybe Erath runs. Erath option, gonna pitch it to Bruno, first down, 25-20. Bruno to the 15, to the 10, down to the... First down and goal from the eight yard line. Hand off to Bruno. At the 10, puts his head down, and he trips to the far side. Bruno the lone setback. Erath. Second and goal from the nine. Flings it out here to Palmore. Palmore juking a man at the 10, stood up, and ridden back at the 11. So, yeah, I think they've got, to, they've got to find somebody on a crossing route. Costello and Nickel to the wide side of the field. High formation, blitz coming. Here it comes. Erath running for his life and is sacked back at the ninth. At the 27-yard line where Gabers will hit the ball from. 7.59 to go in quarter three to snap the spot. The kick is away, and it is. Looked like Gabers didn't get his plant foot down very well and uh, didn't. First and 10 Wildcats from the their own 25-yard line as Kitna backpedals. A blip, dumps it to Christian. He's out to the 27. Football leading it comfortably 21 to nothing. Trips to the wide side. Kitna throws the quick screen out here to Russo. 25-30, gets a great block. 30 drives. Their offense has been a neutral all day. Second down and about four yards to go. Central back at their own 26. Russo in motion to the wide side of the formation. Kitna retreats. Plenty of time. Now hit. Throws. Inter oh, almost intercepted. Two. Applauding their defense. Third and four is the key possession. Trips to the far side. Christian behind Kitna. 21 zip Wildcats. Long count by Kitna. Plenty of time. Dumps it. And Woodard didn't even on their kicking game to make something happen. Have a kicking game opportunity. Stoller to punt, standing on his own 13. Good snap, here comes the rush. Gets it away, kicks it away from Steinauer. He takes it on his own 38 to the 40. 45, jukes a man midfield and falls forward. Yeah. 21 to nothing central. Wiggins and Bruna behind Styles. Double wide near side. Wildcats disguise a blitz. Styles retreats back into the pocket. Flares it out to Bruna. Catches it at midfield to the 45. To the 43 and hurled out back in I think 
uh, you've got to get first downs, maybe get out of bounds, save as much time as possible. you got to get three scores on the board to be in the ball game. Offset eye, second and seven. Western at the central 44-yard line. And Doug Merkovich jumps too soon. They have taken advantage of the things that Western has given them. So the Vikings penalize back to their own 40, uh, to the central 49, second down and nine yards to go. Offset eye, Styles under center, pitches it to Bruna. Bruna trying to get to the corner at midfield, cuts back 45, cuts back again, breaks the tackle, jukes the man 40, first down to the central 39. Drive at a first and goal at the eight, and we're unable to score here in the third period. They played much better in the second half, but they need to play a lot better. Trips to the wide side, the near side, first and 10 from the Wildcat 39. Styles long count, retreats, good blocking, pump fake, throws over the middle, Casello the catch, and he is dropped at the 29. Now 4.40 to go in the third quarter, 21 to nothing, Central Washington trips near side. Nickel, Casello, and Palmore. Bruna offset in the backfield from the Wildcat 29. Here comes the blip. They dump it to Palmore. The lob pass to Nickel. Touchdown, Western Washington. Kevin Palmore, a 29 yard TD pass, and the big spiral. You bet. Big blue on the board. Gabers to try and add the PAT. 21 6, Central Washington. The snap to Erath. He gets it down. Gabers kicks it. And it is good. Timeout on the... Looking for an RV? Look no... Tough for Kitten to hear as the Viking crowd may play a role yet. 21-7, 4 21 to go, third quarter. Central led it 21 to nothing. Gabers to kick it off. Wade approaches the football, thumps one down the field. Taken back by Spears at the 6, to the 10. Running to the far side, to the 15, out to the 20, and knocked down at the 21 yard. It's tough for Kitna to hear. Let's see if they can come through on both counts. First and 10 from the central 21. Russo on motion, long count. Kitna hands it off to Christian. Knocked down in the backfield and loses a yard. Seven, big blue crowd making some noise. They gotta make it tough for the Wildcats. Trips to the wide side, Kitna straight back, blips. And Russo drops the football at the 25-yard line, an official. Randy Carter's in, Orlando Steinauer is in. Viking crowd on its feet, hitting the back, looks, dumps it out here, almost intercepted as Mark Spencer and Steinauer standing about his own 42. Greg Stoller to kick it away, he's standing on his own six. Fourth and 11, good snap, here comes the rush. Line drive boot right to Steinauer, takes it at his 48 midfield. Juke the man and drilled at the center. And the official fortunately gets in between the two. Field position, what it plays in the game. Last time Western got it on Central's 49, this time on their 48. Offset eye formation behind Styles. Nickel to the far side and Costello to the other side. Hand off to Bruno, right up the gut. Breaks one tackle, takes it to the 40 half quarters here this afternoon. But the Viking offense has awakened and put seven on the board, trying for more. Second and eight from the central 45. Styles retreats, corner blitz coming. He throws one out here. Lamont at the 40 to the 35 to the 34. The Vikings break the huddle. They trail it 21 to seven. Offset, to, now it's more of a split backs with the two Johns, Frazier and Bruna. Nickel, the lone wide out. Palmore, the slot back. Styles back. Styles look, dumps it to Frazier. He catches 25-20. Juke the man, takes it to the 19. First down, big blue. First and 10 from the Wildcat 19. Ryan Wiggins and Bruna offset eye. Casello and Nickel split out wide to the left. Wide side of the field. Styles surveying the defense. Jason barking out the signal. Three-step drop. Hits Costello on the quick slant. He gets down. Almost a late hit on center. At the 14-yard line, a minute 10 to go in the third quarter. Offset eye with Wiggins and Bruna. Costello and Nichols set to the far side. Second down, five yards to go. Styles under center. Calls, marks it out. Looks, throws a line drive pass in and out of the hands of Lamont. And good coverage by the first down. Uh, or maybe a little crossing action with uh, Paul Moore and Nickel. Trips to the wide side. Bruno on the lone setback. Third and five from the 15. Styles straight back. 
Pretty good time. Throws. Paul Moore there. Got it at the two. Penalty flags all over the field, though. And I think it's holding on Western line. As Nickel and Costello come out wide to the right, to the far side of the field. Offset eye with Bruna and Wiggins. Styles under center. Jason straight back. Pretty good protection. Looks, looks. Plenty of time. Cranks it for the end zone. Got a man out there. Touchdown. Is it touchdown or not? No, oh. they call it incomplete. As the diving Viking receiver. And the ball is at the, e -Rath will put it down at the 35-yard line. He puts it down and Gabers with a long boot. And it is no good. Wide right. So they go with a field goal. If you, if you get the points, you keep the momentum going. But Central has turned them away twice. Credit to their defense. Kitna, play action, reverse roll, plenty of time. Being pursued, lobs it, hits Josh Woodard, who's upended and dropped by Randall. Play here in the third quarter. Wildcats in control, 21-7. Trips to the near side, first and 10. Kitna retreats. Dumps it to Jamie Christian. Great block. Christian 40, 45, 50, 45. Tackled out of bounds at the Western 45-yard line. And uh, then also had a touchdown nullified and then missed a field goal. First and 10 central from the Western 45. They lead it by 14. Kitna straight back. Looks, looks. Throws one behind Christian with three seconds to offense, and I think if you try and go away from it, you hurt yourself. I think they've got the right idea. Stick with what got you here. Second and 10 from the Viking 45. Three seconds to go. They throw the quick screen to Henderson. Gets to the outside 45 and run out of bounds. He might have a first down, and I think he does. Peach Trees non-stop warranty, which guarantees it for as long as you own your home. In the second season for Western Washington, Central on the march. First and 10 on the Viking 34-yard line. Wildcats on top, 21-7. Christian behind Kitna. John drops straight back into the pocket. Rifles one wide open the tight end, and a penalty flag flies. In control here, 21-7. Break the huddle. First down, 24 yards to 26 yards to go. Trips to the far side. Kitna play action. Bird for grab. No holding call. Unbelievable as Kitna scrambles to the 40. Oh, my. 389 yards of passing right now. Brilliant by Kitna. Second down for Central. 16 to go. Kitna after the 10-yard scramble, dumps it over the middle to Christian, lumbering up the field. No, that's Todd Murray, the tight end, takes it to the 29. Came out of reach if uh, they can get any points at all on this drive. Third and five from the Western 29, 13-20 to go in the ball game. Kitna, long count, straight back into the pocket, dumps it. First down, leaping, diving catch by Todd Murray at the Western 14. Put more of a man-to-man -man coverage and make sure that those two guys are covered. Wildcats with a very impressive drive here, threatening to put this game out of reach. They lead at 21-7. Kitten on a first and 10 from the 13, rolls right, finds the slot back Woodard, jukes a man inside the five, dives for the goal line, and has finally dropped. Dusty South and Mark Dahl doing a fabulous job this afternoon. Kitna will go over 400 yards, and Central can pretty much lock this one up with a TD here. First and goal from the Western two. Christian, the lone running back, throws it out here, and in and out of the hands of Henderson, and there goes the penalty flag. I was down, drove deep into Central territory, had a TD nullified by holding and missed a field goal, and the Wildcats have stormed right back down the field. First and goal from the one. Kitna accepts the snap, and penalty flags right to be announced. First and goal from the Western Washington six. Double wide with Rousseau and Henderson to the wide side, near side of the field. They throw the fade, and it is almost a leaping catch by Henderson. Got his second and goal from the six. 12-28 to go in the ball game. Wildcats on top by 14. Man in motion. Kitna throws the crossing route. Touchdown, Central Washington. E.J. Henderson ran the quick slant, beat McIntosh, and the Wildcats lead it now 27 to 6 and in five yards right down the field and that's what you call taking the the momentum and the and the hope that the vikings had maybe right out of them yeah well you know central can't lay down right now vikings have still got that scoring potential the snap it took you to find that box with the coffee maker in it touchdown from six yards out stoller thumps one down the field ryan wiggins drops the football picks it up at his three across the 10 to the 15 to the 20 to the 25, and he's knocked down at the to two. It does happen sometimes. And, and, you know, it's not over yet. There's a lot of time, but Western's going to have to make some things happen in a hurry here on offense. 
split backs with the two Johns, Frazier and Bruno behind Styles. Jason straight back. The blitz is on. They swing it out to Frazier. Catches it at the 20, 25, 30, 35, and steps out of bounds. About but Frazier doing a smart thing, getting out of bounds, conserving all the time possible. Paul Moore, Casello, and Nichols split out to the wide side, the near side. Bruno the lone setback. Now John comes in motion to the far side of the field. Styles flips it out here to Paul Moore. Got a good block on the corner. Kevin to the 40, to the 45, stood up and gets out of bounds. Wise to go. Vikings trail 28-7, 12-01 to go in the ballgame. John Frazier on the slot, in the slot to the wide side. Nickel out there as well. Mario Casello near side. Styles five-step drop. Here comes the blitz. Jason scrambles, grabbed, and wrapped up and set. The Vikings are going to use need every bit of their acumen and expertise and a little bit of good luck to come back here this afternoon. They trail 28-7. Second down and 16. The Vikings on their own 41. Three-step drop. Styles throws. Hits Nickel on a slant. First down to the central 40. Need to look for a lot of those inside routes. Ball at the central 40. First and 10. Central on top, 28-7. Nickel and Paul Moore to the near side. Costello far side. Bruno the setback. Styles straight back, looks, throws over the middle, and Ryan Lamont not there. Fans yelling for interference, but the official game. Paul Moore checks out. Ryan McGowan and Mario Casello to the near side. John Frazier in the slot. Bruno on the lone setback. Here comes the blip. Styles looks, crossing pattern. Frazier the catch, and he's flung down about the 32 yard. Vikings need a score. Third down and two. From the central 32-yard line, Wiggins and Bruna behind Styles, Nickel and Cassell. What I, do you look for here? I think a little play action where you fake it to the back, uh, look for the receivers deep. If they're not there, then you hit one of the backs coming out of the backfield for the first down. High formation, Nickel and Casello set to the wide side, the near side. Vikings on the central 32. Styles throws the crossing pass and almost caught by Nickel. The ball was deflected too for the Vikings. Costello and Nickel to the near side. Bruno the setback. Christian Evans is in the slot. Fourth down, two yards to go. They've got to reach the 30. They give it to Bruno. Bruno gets the first down to the 30. John cuts back and knocks down at the 27. They're looking for the deep route, and it looks like they've been going with man coverage. Uh, they're going cover two now, it looks like. First and 10 uh, Western from the central 27-yard line. Vikings trail by three TD. They throw it to Bruno. John with a catch at the 30. Sprints to the sideline, driven out of bounds. Good play by the wide pass from slot back Kevin Palmore to Chris Nickel. Now Nickel and Costello come out to the wide side, the near side. Offset eye formation. Second and 10 from the Wildcat 27. Styles back. Here comes the blip. Styles looks, throws a pass and skips it to Nickel. And Central jumping out to a 21 to nothing halftime lead. And the Vikings. A little flurry in the third quarter, but the Wildcats have rebounded from uh, that rally. Styles back, lobs it down the middle. Paul Moore there, touchdown, Western Washington. Kevin Paul Moore right down the middle. Right shoulder at the five and streaked into the end zone. 28-13, Central on top. Nine and a half minutes to go. Vikings will try and add the extra point. The snap at the low one, and the kick is up. And it's good. And the optometrist next to lens crafters. Are uh, within the 20 yards of the kicker, and you might get a lucky break. So Gabers to kick it. I think the Vikings will kick it deep. Uh, they bounce it, and it bounces into the hands of uh, Wildcat at the 30. He reverses field. Bad mistake. Grabbed by Hader and hammered down at the 25. <laughs> right now has to really come with pressure on Kitna to try and create turnovers. First and 10 Wildcats. Kitten is thrown for 433 yards today. In motion is Dolan Holt. The handoff to Christian, and he is drilled in the backfield. Vikings need a three and out or a turnover to have a shot. Rusa and Henderson to the near side. Man in motion is Rusa. Central on their own 24. Kitten back into the pocket. Flings one out. Big, big play for Western. They've really got to be coming and looking for it. Second down, Central, 15 yards to go from their own 20. They've got to take it, in fact, out to their own 36. Trip. Here comes the blitz. They throw it to Russo, running to the outside, pull down from behind. Nice play by Randy. For the, for the Vikings, it's almost critical. They've got to get the ball back here. They run trip to the far side. Big blue fans on their feet. Kittner taking his time. Third down. 
Wildcats on their own 22-yard line. They've got to get to the Western 36. Eight seconds on the play clock, seven. Kitna will accept the snap about two and does back into the pocket. Throws it out here, incomplete, and pressure forcing it, and you're going to get hit. So Stoller to kick it, standing on his own nine. Eight minutes to go, high snap, here comes the rush. He gets it away, booming kick. Steinauer backpedals, takes it at his 35, gets a block 40. Juke and a man going to head out of bounds and runs out of bounds at the 47. To take a lot of time off of the clock or anything, they, each team would start at the 25-yard line, just play it just like a normal football game. And they would play just on one end of the field. But there's a lot to go before that is even a factor. 28-14 Central, Western first and 10 from their own 47. Dial straight back, pretty good protection. Dumped it out here, John Frazier at the Central 49. Frazier dump go with a no huddle here to have a shot. They go with trips to the far side, Nickel, Costello, and Palmore. Bruno on the lone setback, second down. Six minutes and 20 seconds to go in the ball game. Bruno on motion. Dials back, dumps it over the middle, almost intercepted. Scott Lamaster got a hand on it. There's still some time left. You can't panic or throw too deep. You got to get a first down here. They picked up a fourth down play in their last drive. And Central's going with man coverage. And here comes the blitz. Styles fumbles the football. It's kicked, still loose. No one sees it. And Western recovers back at the Viking Bells. And this is the ball game, folks. Fourth down, 11 for Western. They have the ball on their own 46-yard line. They've got to reach the central 42. High formation, double wide near side. Styles straight back. Looks, throws. Nichols got it. He's got to get a first down. He does. Spins away from a couple of guys and takes it. Put the ball on the 27. First and 10 Western with 518 to go in the ball game. Trips to the far side. Styles back. Looking, looking. Bruna open. Throws it over here. Frazier one-on-one. -on -one. Needs to get out of bounds. And he does. Frazier running his race of the crowd here at Civic Stadium with a comeback here in the second half. Second down and five from the central 24-yard line. In motion is Kevin Palmore. Styles under center. Here comes the blitz. Styles back into the pocket. Looks. Throws the home run. Got Palmore out there. And no flag flies. That they've got to go to. Nichols getting the double coverage, and uh, that's hard to throw into. Third. Third down, five yards to go. Western from the central 24-yard line. Double wide far side. Bruno the setback. Styles retreats. Back to pass. Dumps it over the middle. And it's intercepted by Central at the five-yard line. A style turnover by my unofficial tally this afternoon. And driving with five minutes to go. Turn it over again. First and 10 Central on the three. Now the Viking defense has got to come up with a miracle. They hand it off to Jamie Christian. He's hit and dropped at the three. Put up despite a spirited Western comeback here in the final half. Second down and 12 from the central three-yard line. Western needs a turnover. They hand it off to the running back, and he is drilled. Choose to take a safety and then just kick it away later. That's possible. Third down and 13 from their own one. Kitna back into the pocket. Look, look. Throws, almost intercepted, but a good play by Brian McIntosh. His coaching staff with a 14-point end zone. So Greg Stoller standing just inside the back line. It's 28 to 14. And it looks like they may take the safety. Let's wait and see. Awaiting the snap, low snap. Stoller boots it away, away from Steinauer. Nice kick. It bounces at the 38, Steinauer at the 40, and steps out of bounds at the 35-yard line. They do have a shot now, and, uh, and that's uh, really kind of a surprise. Yeah, uh, I mean, hey, with three minutes left, there's still an opportunity to win the ball game. Uh, they've got to get to the end zone quickly, though. First and 10, Vikings on the central 35, double wide near side, Styles back into the pocket. Bruno stays in for protection, throws the out. And the catch by Ryan Lamont, who kind of right up to the line of scrimmage. The wrong fellas onto the field. And uh, Christian Evans has got to get off the field or else they're going to have 12 men on the field. First and 10 from the Central 23. They've got the wrong guys out there. Let's see what happens. Styles throws the home run. Palmore, Palmore is there. there. Oh, and he's knocked away at the one-yard line. And in 10 for the Vikings. They trail 28-14. Second and 10 from the Wildcat 23-yard line. 28-14 Central Washington. The winner goes on. The loser eliminated from the national playoffs. Styles back, dumps it, 
to Palmore in a crossing pattern. He's oh, hammered. He's got to throw and that. First and 10 for the Vikings from the Wildcat 11. They need to score. 2.55 to go in regulation. Trip to the far side. Bruna and Nickel to the near side. Central going to come on a blitz. Style straight back. Here they come. It's the screen. They throw it to Brunei. Drops the ball, and that's probably a good play. Yeah, he, he, if he'd have caught 13, the winner will advance to the NAIA Division II quarterfinals. The loser is done for the year. Brune on the lone setback. Styles under center. Double wide near side, the wide side. Styles backpedals. Looking. Steps up into the pocket. Going to run. Styles at the five. Puts his head down. And his hand play here. 2.29 to go in the ball game. Western trails it 28 to 14. Clock continuing to tick. Third down and about two and a half. Styles throws it. Nickel grab. Touchdown, Touchdown. Western Washington. Make a play. Well, I think you do what they did the last time. You kick that hard squib that goes right along the ground or a real low hard kick. Maybe you get it to bounce off somebody. If not, it's going deep enough down the field that, you know, they don't have great field position. And then you just got to work to really get the ball. The snap, the spot, the kick is away and good. Right back. As Larry sat wedged between... Wade Gabers has the ball teed up on the Western 35 to kick it. He's lining up for an onside kick. And Central has 10 people between their own 45 and the Western 35. I'd like to see him pooch it over the front line. Let's see what happens. Gabers approaches the ball. And he does kick it 10 yards. And it's covered immediately by Central. Part, part of the problem with this soft ground is you don't... Is covered by the Wildcats on their own first down, and they've got it wrapped up. Yeah, Western's really got to bring the house on this. First and 10, Kitna hands it off to Christian. He's dropped for a loss in the backfield. A loss of a yard seven times, and so far it's number eight, and that is the difference in the ball game. Second and 12, Central on their own 47. Christian the setback. Double wide near side, Kitna straight back. Almost has the ball picked off. It's loose, still loose, and they call it incomplete. There and got a hand up, and it bounced off of his hand. Here. The ball on the central, 48. Trips to the near side. Troutman, Rusai, and Henderson. Back goes Kitna. He throws it, and it is caught by Henderson. First down and more, and that'll do it. That's the ball game. And it's proved to be just a little bit too big of a mountain to climb. First and 10 from the Viking 33, and Kitna drops to a knee on a rainy, kind of gloomy afternoon here in Bellingham, doesn't turn the ball over at all. Kitna takes it. I just don't think Western came out early in the game really ready to play, or maybe too ready to play. Kitna has a dance going on on the central sideline, and then in the field, Kitna jumping up and down and hugging Montre Macon as the Wildcats celebrating and get a nice round of applause here from...